Hey, welcome back to another edition of Babyface Brew Review. My name is Alex. I'll be walking you guys and gals to this review for the next few minutes here today. We've got a really cool offering from none other than Lagunitas Brewing Company out of Petaluma, California and Chicago, Illinois. This is the latest 2019 uh, one hitter series release. This is Phase Change, which is a super interesting offering because it's a seasonally unexpected wet hopped juicy ale. Essentially, they're, they're kind of like freeze drying hops, I believe, in like liquid form, and then uh, from the, the 2018 fall hop harvest, and then um, utilizing them six months later so that you can have basically a fresh hop beer, um, you know, in non in non-harvest season. So really, really cool. They did this last year with Born Again yesterday. Uh, that was really, really solid, I thought. Obviously not as fresh as Born Yesterday, which is their um, pinnacle beer in my opinion. I think it's the, the best offering from them, but that's just my opinion. What does that matter? Uh, other than that, um, specs of the beer, 7.4% alcohol by volume, 60 IBUs, no rating from Beer Advocate. This beer is brand spanking new. Uh, untapped had 4.33 out of 5 caps, but only from about 35 ratings or so, so not much to go off of there. I don't have a hop profile nor a malt bill, unfortunately. But uh, you can find this beer in 12 ounce, six packs, and on draft where you can get Lagunitas beer. Um, I can read the description real quick. It says, We're born yesterday. Rush delivers fresh hop harvest to your buds. It leaves the brewers questing for those holy grail flavors year round. It, it led to a new wet hop process born again yesterday, proved damn near divine. Today we're changing it further. The ambrosial nectar, juicy and hazy for a reason, it's unfiltered. Um, there you go. Phase change. So a little take on um, Born Again yesterday. This bottling date is 135, um, which is the 135th day of the year, obviously, there. Uh, putting at May 15th. Today's date is the 20th, so we're just about five days old. Super, super fresh. Um, let's go ahead and uh, crack the cap and get, in, get into the Born Again or excuse me, the phase change by Lagunitas Brewing Company. Sorry, it's been a real long day. I had a golf tournament this morning, then I ran a couple miles so I can enjoy this bad boy with you guys and gals. Try to make sure, yeah, calories are in count there or whatnot. But uh, yeah, this looks awesome in the glass. It's very similar to Born yesterday. Some cloudiness there, kind of golden amberish color with a nice, um, beautiful, really tightly compact off-white khaki color head there. Nice retention in the glass as always from Lagunitas. Mild carbonation streaming up from the bottom there. Actually active somewhat. So really, really nice looking beer in the glass there. Let's get into a aroma and a smell in this bad boy. Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. Um, definitely smells very, very similar to Born Again Yesterday and Born Yesterday. Bold citrus right up in your face. I get ruby red grapefruit, uh, some nice tangerine zest in this one. A little bit of pepperiness from like the alcohol. Tropical fruit, pineapple, mango, passion fruit, a little guava, a little peach in there, some honeydew melon qualities. Then there's that grassiness element that we've known to come and love, kind of the dankness, the, the green vegetal side of things, a little bit of cannabis in there. Earthiness. Really, really nice. Some pine, some spruce, caramel sweetness. Really, really awesome smelling beer. Just permeating out of the glass here. Um, cheers, Prost, whatever the hell you want to call it. This is Phase Change by Lagunitas Brewing Company, Petaluma, California. Could just pound this whole thing. It's awesome. Holy smokes. Um, up front, kind of this honey sweetness, pound cake like sweetness, a little bit of caramel sweetness as well. Malt foundation laying the way for big, big uh, citrus notes. Big red grapefruit like falling the nose there. Tangerine. Um, also get some kind of like lemon lime mandarin thing going on as well. Orange. I wasn't picking that lemon lime up in the aroma, but I'm definitely getting it here. Pineapple, passion fruit, um, some mango as well in there. And then as on the back end, we start to get some of that resiny bitterness and we start to transition into more of the piney, uh, sprucey kind of 
leafy forest floor kind of notes, that little bit of kiss of dankness in there. There is kind of this peppery spice as well, which is nice uh, in the back end. Really, really drinkable. Uh, getting into the feel of the beer, it's really, really nice on the medium side, kind of medium lightish, really nice creamy body, really crisp, uh, very, very drinkable. 7.4%, you'd never know that. I mean, you, you would never know. It's really, really good. Nice and crisp. Um, nice dry finish, you know, a little bit of sweetness up front, and you get a nice snappy dry finish. Really, really awesome offering from Lagunitas Brewing Company, Phase Change, uh, IPA here, this wet hopped beer. Now you might be asking and wondering, does it is it the same as Born Yesterday? No, absolutely not. It does not pop like Born Yesterday does. There's that kind of vegetal, uh, really greeny, oily, resinous um, complexion that you get with that. There's a, that huge element. This is a little more muted, a little more subdued. Yes, it's really, really hoppy, and it's it, it's very perfumey in terms of the fragrance and um, the taste. But it doesn't doesn't pop like Born Yesterday. That's a that's on a different level. But for a beer that you know you're drinking in May or June, this is a pretty awesome kick-ass offering from these guys. This is definitely one of they're better beers that I would say they make now that this is out. This is very, very enjoyable. So as for a grade, 93 out of 100, it's definitely an A beer. A, a beer, I think 94. Let's go 94. It's really, really solid. You guys definitely should check this out. That's what matters. matters what you guys and gals think. So 94 from me. But let me know in the comment section down below. Did you love it? Did you hate it? What did you think of the Lagunitas phase change from... Pedal in California and Chicago, Illinois. And until next time, guys, I appreciate each and every one of you. And we'll see you all again on Bayface Brewery. Thank you so much for stopping by.